Welcome back to Tears of the Kingdom, peeps. It is regional phenomenon time. Which means shooting up a tower. And then falling back down. Wow, we nearly hit that. Uh, fly, Link. Fly. The regional phenomena. Phenomena? Re re the, re the regional phenomenon is right over there. Right in Zora's kingdom. Right in the middle. And that's where we're going. That's what we're aiming for. That's what we're going to do. Now, there's probably going to be some sort of epic journey to get there, like there was with uh, the other one. I'm not wearing my flying suit at the moment, but it's fine. There is a shrine down there. That'll be a useful thing for us to get. And it's been a while since I've been to Zora's Kingdom. I haven't been here since Breath of the Wild. And it's now covered in gunk. Which means all the water's unswimmable, guys. It just won't do. And there's more gunk falling down from the sky. Oh, jeez, there's just gunk everywhere. This just won't do. This just won't do at all. Right, let's uh, unlock this shrine. Mogawak Shrine. I, I guess we should probably do it, seeing over here. I thought you were doing the forget about shrines and doing regional phenomena. Well, I, I'm here now, though, aren't I? Jeez, I'm expecting this to take a long time with the journey anyway, so... Uh, couple of minutes in here won't hurt what if it's one of the complicated ones and you spend four hours there um well then this could be a slow few videos the power of water at mogawak shrine power of water that sounds easy for a foxy no tail i'm all about the power of water peeps it's what foxy no tails do best we have over here a lever of some sort we have a stick that we can Power the water with. Okay, we need to make a water wheel. That's fine. Water wheels are easy. They want uh, duck shots, not Foxy No Tail. Who's, who's Foxy No Tail? Never heard of him. That's what they do best. Let's stick that on there. There we go. Uh, well, let's grab that chest out of there. Let's open it, see what's in it. A magic scepter. We just got rid of one of them. All right, fair enough. I suppose we didn't get rid of it. We, uh, uh, we made a new one. No, we fused it. I guess we need to put this on the top. And then give it a spin to get it started. There we go. Let's uh, stick that on there as best we can. Just like that. There we go. And if we give it a little spin, that should get it started. Go. There we go. Perpetual motion, peeps. That's what I'm talking about. So we now have electricity. Which means we can charge up this thing. I'm assuming this is some sort of energy cell. And I think it needs charging. So uh, let's stick that on here. I can't believe I was actually right. It is. Okay. Well, that, that made that life easy then. Jeez. What a guess. I guess it does look a little bit like the other energy cell things. But now we need to, to power this with that, I guess. <laughs> not like that. No, not stuck on the wing. Oh, do we do we need to put it on top of uh, here? Is this where the energy comes in? It is. Okay. So the energy goes there. That thing flies up there without me. Okay. So we need to turn it off. And then put it on when we're standing on that thing. There's another energy thing over here that I guess will conduct through these balls that are in the water, which we could potentially stick to each other. Not quite. Huh. Well, in that case, then, I wonder. I wonder if we can stick that uh, energy thing between them. Or if that's what we're supposed to do last. Let's find out. Let's see. Let's pop it down here and see if we can... Uh... Oh, we just put it in the water and that opens it. But then we can't get a crop. Huh. Hmm. Of course, it all makes sense. Let's put it there. Well, it's out of juice now, anyway. Maybe it'll have enough to get through. Oh, actually, if we have, if it has enough to get through the door, will we get back out again? Let's uh, let's just drag that chest over a little bit closer to the door. Let's bring that. Can I open it from there? No, I can't. Okay, is it going to have enough juice just to power that door? It's not. Oh, that sucks. Fine. We'll go charge it up again. I'll be back in a second. Okay, it is now charged. 
all I've got to do is plonk it on there. That should give us enough power to light up that, which can open that. Did it fall off? It did. Just go on, on that thing, mate. That's all you need to do. Just go on there. There we go. Just for long enough to, for me to get in here. Open this. And ideally not get locked in. An opal. Well, that was really worth it. Jeez. Okay. Good. It didn't totally defuse itself either this time, which is nice. Uh, yeah, I shouldn't have done that. Ow. Ow. <laughs> I didn't drop anything, so that's good. Normally you lose your items when you get electrified, but I guess this just doesn't have that much charge. Right, I'm going to go charge it up again. And uh, the good thing is, it works when it's laid down. You don't even have to stand it up. Fantastic. This works perfectly. Pop it on there. Charges up. Grab it. Take it over here. Get on the little device. Up we go. And uh, jobs are good. Shrine done. Easy. Probably, I've told you, the power of water. It's what uh, people like me do best. There we go. Up we go. Up we go. I could have probably just ascended through that, couldn't I? I don't know if it was too high up to ascend, but there we go. Done. Try and complete. Thank you for the light of blessing. Ah, oh, there we go. We have enough now for either two hearts or two more stamina wheels. We should probably go and hand that in at some point and get those things. But not right now. We are investigating a regional phenomenon. Phenomena? Phenomenon. Phenomenon. Or not, maybe. I don't know. Which means I now need to get up there. How can earth can I do that? It's going to be impossible. How can I possibly get up? Well, then. Come here, frack. Oh, crab. I, I, I need crab. Yeah, as I was saying, how am I possibly going to get up there? It's impossible, guys. It can't be done. Oh, wait. There we go. Just use the magic power of flying upwards through blocks because that's how this game works. Oh, and look, all the people are here to talk to. That vile sludge. Uh, splash fruit. The more injuries anticipated than I accept my apology. Nothing to apologize for. I'm going to do something about that statue. No problem. I can do something about that statue. Hi there, traveler. Sludge falling from the ceiling. Uh, can you fix it? Probably can. No problem. Mm. Just discussion how we need to wash away the sludge. I apologize. Cannot provide a great deal of hospitality. Please do make yourself at home here. Don't worry about it, guys. I uh, So she was on about a splash fruit. So, I mean, that's one way we could deal with it. The op op the other way we could deal with it would be to uh, literally just get one of my fire hydrants out and squirt it with that. But I guess if we can splash fruit it, it's worth a go, isn't it? We've got loads of splash fruits. We don't really use them. There you go. Did it, guys. The sludge. I see you managed to wash it away. The statue is a symbol of hope for the Zora. It's very precious to us. Thank you so much for cleaning it. In truth, the statue depicts something. The beloved Prince Sidon on Zora uh, and Zora on his best friend, Sir Link, the heroic Hylian swordsman. <laughs> That's me. Simply wonderful. And if you want, say, say you have a similar stature to the Hylian hero. Similar eyes as well. And also, oh my, you are also Hylian. And a swordsman. <laughs> Wait, could it be? It is. It's me, guys. I'm back. Are you Link, the swordsman of legend? It, well, it really wasn't that long ago. Don't you remember me? Remember, mind your manners, Chroma. Please accept my apology. I will. Please pardon our rudeness. I'm quite surprised to learn that you are legendary swordsman, Sir Link. I have heard mention of you every day since I arrived in this domain. I am Prince Zidans. Oh, forgive me. I am your best friend's fiancé. My name is Yona. I'm truly honoured to have an opportunity to meet you, Sir Link. Hello, Yona. We heard you were uh, missing along with Zelda. What brings you here? Princess is missing. You've got sludge everywhere. I'm going to fix it. Think that such a thing took place beneath Hyrule Castle. If you search through the princess is what brought you to this domain. In that case, feel free to investigate the area around the domain as thoroughly as you see fit. Oh, I have a lovely idea. If you don't mind, I ask you please to meet with Sidon. I'm certain he would be delighted to see you. He will be at Mifa Court, located at the peak Oh, of course he is. Because he's at the top of a mountain. Why wouldn't he be anywhere else? Oh. 
Patrick, we must be going now. And so when we were in Zora's Domain last time, we got this amazing swimming suit that allowed us to swim fast, which was nice. Um, if you could have met with Sidon, perhaps you could visit me at the infirmary on the floor above. Determined to be of assistance to you as best as I can to link. Oh, don't you be falling in love with me instead of Sidon. Don't want to be in a weird love triangle with me best friend. But she seems a bit keen, guys. She seems a bit keen. Now, I could really do to see uh, the royalty here. But it doesn't look like we're going to be able to. The, I think there used to be a shrine in this room, if I remember correctly. Last time I was here. Many, many ago in Breath of the Wild, but it doesn't look like it's there anymore. But the shrines from that game no longer exist in this one, which is a bit bizarre, really. Got a cooking pot. Now, there were shops and stuff kicking around uh, in this place last time as well, if I remember correctly. This looks like somewhere to sleep. Lost many customers because of the sludge. Are you And we're unsure that Sasan has gone off to... My daughter is quite attached to him. We're all worried. Uh, must return to my work. Thank you for coming by. Enjoy your sleep as deep as the ocean in the seabed inn. Will you be staying? Uh, 20 rupees. Uh, no, not right now. Hi. Okay, we're always open. If you're not going to do po pony points, mate, I ain't staying. Pony points or nothing. That's how I am. That's how I roll. What we got going on here? A shop. Ah, Hylian rice. Yes, I want it. All of them. Yes. <laughs> and what are these? Swift violet. Uh, I don't know if I've got any of those. I'll take one. Forty rupees. What a rip up. We've got loads of Hylian tomatoes. Don't need those. I got a whole bunch of arrows. I don't need those. Thank you very much for your service. Oh, do you want to buy any of my stuff? Not that I dare sell it now. The, the, the uh, fairy fountains need everything. I want to sell. Oh. Uh, what we got? What we got? What we got? What do we got of value? We got any topaz and things? We do. I don't want to sell my diamonds. We need those. That's not really worth much anymore. We've got loads of money. No, I'm not going to sell anything. Oh. Thank you very much. See you later. Uh, Hylian footsteps, nothing from you. So we need to get up to the top of that mountain. So, I guess the easiest way to do that is probably to go back up the tower and fly. That makes the most sense. Because scaling these rocks is not going to be easy. Oh, another little crab. Take it. It's a bit of a maze, this place. One could almost say... It's amazing. I mean, you could. Whether or not you should or not, that's a different story altogether. Oh. Is this the place to uh, see the king? I remember the king was a pretty big guy last time I was here. Amazing, amazing brother. No sign of the king. Okay. I guess he don't like it in his, his chair no more. Okay, fine. No question marks on any of their heads, so no little side missions there. That's absolutely fine. Not a problem. Any secret chests hiding behind the king's chair? No. Okay, let's hop down over here. And head towards that mountain. Uh, there's a walk away there. Oh, yeah, the swimming suit that we got before allowed us to swim up waterfalls. I remember now, you used to go flying out the top of it. Jeez. Ahoy, waterfall, they say. But I I don't know whether we'll get that in this game. We, I mean, we might do. But we're probably not going to need it, especially with all this sludge about. And you don't really want, want to be going up a sludge waterfall now, do you? But we do somehow need to get to the top of this. Now, is there anything behind the waterfall? What I want to know. Yes, and also... Oh, yes. I can't swim fast enough to get there. I can. Here we go. Nice. Is this a secret way up the mountain? Discovery. Pristine Sanctum. The Great Spring. So if we had that fish suit, I get, I bet we could uh, swim straight up that. We can't because we don't have it. Hmm. 
Okay, well that was a bit of a waste of time coming in here then. So I guess if that exists, then yes, we are absolutely going to be getting our uh, fish suit back again. But uh, I don't think today is going to be that day. You never know. Are we going to get washed off the edge here? Or are we going to be all right? No, we're going to get washed off the edge. And now we're going to be stuck against this rock. Ugh. Swimbling. Oh, jeez, and it's, is that ice covering that as well? So that's going to make life tricky to get up there. Um, I'm wondering if uh, flying up, flying up with the tower is going to be the easiest way to get up there. We've got this thing, which is the dam, and on the other side of that was the uh, Divine Beast in Zelda. But it does have a staircase going up, so that might make life easy to get to the top. Run, run, as fast as you can. You can't catch me, because I'm swordsman. The legendary swordsman, Link, and I'm going to kill the bad guy at the end. Even though all of those people with all those special powers couldn't do it, I can do it. There we go. This is where the divine beast was. It was just kicking about in there. Uh, we're not really much higher up. A little bit, but nowhere near as high as we need to be. There's a nice, uh, nice bed here and sleep. Ah, I guess, why not? Sleep in uh, whoever's bed this is. Cheaper than the other one. Uh, maybe hot air balloon. Maybe hot air balloon is the way to go here. Do we get in trouble for sleeping in whoever's bed this is? No? Huh. No, it's just a free bed. Okay. Uh, yes, look, here we go. Oh, uh, here's all the equipment you need to uh, build a... Oh, no, this is to build a raft. Don't need to build a raft. I wonder if it's going to be like, oh, you need to plug up the sludge mountain thing up there. All coming up from up there, fix it, Link. Only you can save us. We don't understand how to go up in the air because we're fish people. We understand the water and the water's all brown, mate. It's all a bit brown and sticky. Like a brown stick, but um, not quite as brown as a brown stick. It's slightly a little bit less brown than a brown stick. Okay, it's time to make the flying machine. What am I going to need? I'm going to need a cart, don't roll down the hill, a hot air balloon. And a flame emitter, which we are running out of. And then I should have one of these stored in my memory bank. In my favourites, with a bit of luck. I do and I don't. No, I haven't saved this as a favourite. Okay. Okay, well, we'll build it and we'll save it as a favourite then. No. <laughs> Put the lime in the coconut and stick them both together. Attach. Auto build. Save two favorites. Now, a torch is ideal in this situation. It allows us to continue going up. We'll use a battery first and then the torch. I don't know how the game expected us to go up there. I mean, probably this. But I guess there would have prob probably been a walkway through. But without unlocking those waterfalls, it might have been a bit tricky. Can we get high enough up there to actually fly, fly across, though? The tower's not far away, so yeah, I reckon we could have easy made it up here from the tower. I don't think that would have been a problem at all. My battery's about done. But we're nearly there. There's a shrine over there, and it looks like there's a chap. Or someone standing on the edge. And is it a statue? Maybe. When we get high enough, we shall fly, float over there like a leaf on the breeze. 
get that shrine and go and uh, speak to old whatever his name was Dorian what was not Dorian could have been Dorian might have been I can't remember not definitely not Dorian Dorian pretty sure okay I think we've gone up high enough have a bit of a gust get the fast travel point unlocked do this really easy shrine because of course it's going to be really easy just like the other one Ooh, what was that a, oh they've got these square things here that we've seen elsewhere but we don't actually know what they do oh we gotta uh, we gotta clean it mate uh we don't want that we want um for splash fruit There we go. Oh. Fixed. Skip. So this is the... Any minute now. Mid-air per mid perch. Mid-air perch. Ihan Ashrine. Oh, can those things just float? Those things can just float? So you activate them and they just float? What? Oh, we're learning now. So if I just drop that, it's going to drop. But if I... Oh, I don't want to use my uh, torch. It's too expensive. I can just put it there. That's useful. Very useful. Okay. Uh, nothing up there. Looking for chest. The climbing thing. We can stick to things and it can... No. Maybe. Yeah, that's, that's two... That's the exact right length for that. However... Science guys, things are longer on the diagonal. Oh, they've thought about that. You sneaky sneakers. Okay, fine. We'll do what the game wants us to do. That's fine. Stick. Whack. <laughs> nice. I guess we're going to need it again. Is there... Oh, there's ladders there. Why is the ladders here? Come on, game. At, at the ladders. There we go. Oh, I thought there might have been a chest there. There isn't. Okay, that's fine. Oh, I see. I know why those ladders are there. I guess we're going to have to... Oh, no, no, no. We can just angle it. I was going to say we might have to, uh, like, jump across and float, but no. Nice. I told you this one was going to be easy. No way. What? Okay. Come here. Put that there. Dig a ball on it. Put it there. Hit that. Off it goes. I mean, is that how I'm supposed to go across as well? I reckon I could probably make that, but just in case. Ah, there's the... Uh, there's a chest, so we just need a couple of stepping stones here then. Probably shouldn't have sent both of those over because it would have been easier if I didn't. But uh, with a bit of luck, I can hop up these, maybe. There we go. Up on there, up on there, and then... Oh, almost. Almost. Okay, that's fine. There we go. A little bit higher up. Just like that. No, no link. That's not what I wanted. Hut, hut, hut. 
And when you got on it before, there we go. There we go. What's in the chest? Arrows. Nice. Okay, so, do we... Oh, I should have just flown from up there. I was going to say, do we try and fire ourselves across? And is that going to be successful? Or should we climb up there and float across? Let's find out. Oh, we, we can do that. Wow, okay. These things are now my new best... Most favorite things. I don't know why. I don't know what they do. I know what they do, but I don't know how they would be useful. But I love them. There we go. Biddly buddly bing. Another shrine done. All right, let's go find Dorian. Not called Dorian. It's finding Dorian, mate. Finding Dorian. Would you rather call him Nemo? Shrine done. And here we are, back here. So, we've got some peeps over here, standing about in this wall. What's they do? What's they do? Uh, no question mark. Is this him? Is this my friend? Uh, huh? It is. Huh? Is it? Really, you? Huh. Sidon, Prince of the Zora. It's not Sidon, Dorian. It's good to see you, my friend. <laughs> Link, it's been far too long. I received word you've gone missing. I was beside myself with concern. Whatever could have transpired? Loads of stuff, mate. Oh, really? Ah, oh, and afterwards I mysteriously woke on a sky island in the sky? Oh my goodness. My apologies, I've actually been wondering if those floating sky islands could be the source of the falling sludge. That's why I've tasked Zora Historian with investigating ruin fragments and the historical documents to the sky. As for me, I'm not at liberty to leave this spot at present. I'm uniquely qualified to deal with the sludge here. Hmm. You see, old friend, this place is the source of the water that flows into Zora's domain. That's why it must use my power of water manipulation to separate the sludge from our water in order to clean it. Yeah, you're not doing that much of a good job. If I cease, then the sully water will flow into our beloved home and there will be much pain and suffering. That's why I cannot afford to leave here no matter what. Hmm. Say, Ling, does it not seem the princess's whereabouts might be related to the floating sky islands and the ruins? If so, perhaps you should go and speak to uh, the historian. It's quite possible you could provide you with some useful information. Present, you should be able to find him at Toto Late Lake. By the way, I hope you know that I am truly happy to see you again so after such a long time apart. Visit me anytime you like. Presence is never anything less than welcome and appreciated. Okay. Now, uh, the story about his uh, the missus wanted us to go see her, didn't she? But let's uh, let's see if we can go find her. Steal a couple of grabs on the way. And then and maybe a hot-footed frog or two. I'm assuming, you know, this is leading to where we need to go. It seemed to be the only sort of normal route up. I say normal. I assumed it would be inside, but I guess not. Is she up here? She said the infirmary. This doesn't feel like an infirmary, and that's not her. Do you have a problem, though? Please protect us. No. Where's the infirmary? Oh, there's a Korok. You're all... You st I can't believe how many of these Koroks are just lost. She definitely said on the story above. What did she say on the story below? Ah, oh, maybe. Maybe she said below. Don't worry about me, Dorian. I'm just coming through. Who's this? Mumble. No. No, uh... What is this bit of paper? Mephis Security Report. Day in, day out. Sludge never stops falling. Thanks to Tyler's efforts at the Sidon. Uh, it's all been cleaned. 
Uh, the mountain path to Toto Lake and Dunma is completely covered in sludge. When you want to sneak over there, remember, bring lots of splash fruit. Uh, okay. So where is Toto Lake then? Is that on our map? Lulu Lake, Miku Lake, uh, Pristine Sanctum, Miffa Court, Sidon. I would assume it would East Reservoir, Ruler Dam. What we got here, they're not labelled. That's in a different region. Ah, Total Lake, it's over here. That's where we need to go. Uh, again, we could probably fly there from the tower and avoid all of the sludge, which would probably be a smart thing to do. Where is she? On the level below. So let's uh, let's head this way because it looks like that dropped down to another lake thing. Hip. Hmm. Oh, how am I all the way over there? I gone the wrong way. Oops. My bad. It was an accident. Is that a Really? Go away. Drop your friend. You should pick up the air of Cuda parts. Ah, I mean, I could. Yeah. Yeah. It's a bit sticky, this sludge stuff. What's that say? Miffa Court. Okay. So, infirmary should be at this level here, then. Oh, there she is. Is that her? No, it's not. Huh. Definitely said the level below. Convinced. And that's all the way back down to the bottom. Uh. Hmm. Let's go and have a chat with this lady. Yeah. <laughs> Fishing. No. I'm not a fellow low fishing enthusiast. I'm sorry. Apologise, but it's just not my thing. And baddies. But no sign of, of an infirmary. I just don't get it. Did she say the level below or did she say the level above? It's very difficult to remember when you're useless like I am. I kind of want to be over at that bit. Is that her? Oh. No, she was more green, wasn't she? Mm. Oh. Hmm. Okay, leave it with me, peeps. I'll see what I can do. Okay, I decided to fly down to the next level. I haven't seen any sign of an infirmary yet, but there is this thing. Which, uh... I wonder if I can melt it. I don't really want to waste any more of my, um... Flame emitters. I've only got four left, and they're really useful. I don't think so. But yeah, no no sign of said infirmary. I was trying to follow like the path back, whichever way you would have gone, so you'd have like come along. Maybe she was on about the level below in there. Rather than up here. But I thought, yeah, maybe following the path would uh, would lead us there, but it doesn't look like it's going to. So I'm gonna hop back down here. See if I can find her over there, and if not, then um, 
Yeah, I guess we're just going to go and find that lake. I think she might have meant the level below this. But this is kind of the lowest level. Unless you count this. That's just one of the kids kicking about in there. But like below this is just just the sludge. I don't think there is anything really sort of below. All of the stairs lead up. Nothing leads downwards. So I'm moving back down here with the shrine. There's no infirmary down here. Hmm. Come here, crap. Hmm. Oh, well, I appear to have ascended into uh, what seems to be a jacuzzi area. And isn't that her here? It is. This sludge is really quite stubborn. I dearly hope our patients recover soon. Oh, so this is the infirmary. Right, okay. Oh. Lady Una, sir, Link is here at last. Oh. Oh, you really came. How fortuitous. I was hoping to speak to you about an item that you entrusted the domain with repairing your Zora armor. The repair is mostly complete, but does require one more thing. An ancient Arowana. Uh, I can finish the armor right away if I can somehow acquire a scale from that fish. We've not seen any ancient arowanas around here lately, but I have no idea where they can be found. Since they're used for making armor, Dento the blacksmith may know something about how to get one. If you find one, please bring it to me. Uh, to do that, I shall fix your item. <laughs> and then you'll be able to climb waterfalls. Okay, so it'll prove useful to you. So yeah, it's very useful going to see her. We need to go uh, see a blacksmith then. So where will the blacksmith be? Is it really not going to tell me? Well, who's the blacksmith? Oh my goodness. Okay, I'm going on a wild goose chase again. I'll be back in a minute. Aha! This chap here is probably the blacksmith. So it's you. Do you need something? I see. You seek an ancient arowana. In that case, I've heard whispers that you, uh, what you seek has been spotted at Mipha's statue, which is at the peak of Polymus Mountain. The rare fish has almost never been caught and was used in the distant past to repair Zora armor. Why has it disappeared again? Is this to a result of the upheaval? Okay. Mipha's statue at the peak of Polymus Mountain. Well, here's Polymus Mountain. Uh, and we were pretty much at the peak of that a minute ago when we were near this shrine. So, I guess we just need to go... Oh, there was that fishing lady just down there. But that wasn't the very peak. Hmm. Okay, I'm going to go and run around there and investigate and see if I can find one of these fish. So here we are at the very peak of the mountain. Uh, and there is a fish. Is it the fish that I need, though? It said it's been very hard to catch these fish. Can I catch it? Is there a way I can lure it somehow? Do I need my stealth stuff on? Oh, man. I nearly got it. Come here. There we go, I got one. Oh, they're impossible to catch. Um, are they? Right, I need to go back down there now and uh, take this to uh, my best friend's wife. And I'm nearly there. Just got to drop into the infirmary. Here we go. I got you a fish, my love. I mean, uh, uh, my best friend's girlfriend. I got one. Ancient Arawa, I can finally finish repairing your treasured armor. Just wait a short moment while I go to the workshop. <laughs> One short moment later. So I wanted to reunite with this item link. 
Yes, yes. Your armor's as good as new. There we go. Please take this along with our well wishes. I'm so happy I was able to return it. As well, you know, the Zora armor allows you, even highly unlikely, to climb waterfalls with ease. Oh, really? I can climb? Of course, it will not help you with climbing waters that have been tainted by sludge. Okay. Well, there's a lot of sky islands. I'm sure you'll find a way up that waterfall clouded. That is. I've already been up there. Whoa. Like twice. Use this uh, well for your investigation. So there's loads of sky islands with waterfalls like coming halfway down. So that is... Yes. That's going to be an easy way to get up there. Oh, man. Oh, man. All those ones I was like, oh, it's going to be really hard to get there. I can get there now. So let's go back to here. And in the next episode, we're going to go and find the researcher at Toto's Lake. Thank you all very much for watching. I'll see you then.